Nice work out there, kid. Hey, you got some real moves on you. <laughs> Just tell me that this visit wasn't for nothing. I found the tomb of a Zepho sage. They definitely used the Force. An advanced civilization of Force wielders who mysteriously vanished. No wonder Master Cordova became so obsessed with them. What else did you find? Before they disappeared, the Zepho journeyed to the planet Kashyyyk. Oh. Cordova had a Wookiee friend named Tarful. Maybe we can find him. Sheik, I look, things are really bad down there. The, the Empire's muscling in on those Wookiees big time. Then we better get ready for a fight. Oh. I think this lifestyle suits you. Fighting that walker seems to have made you more confident. So, how are you holding up? I mean, with the Force? Yes, with the Force. I know you said it could be overwhelming. Haven't gotten myself killed yet. Rather not talk about it. Yeah, well, I understand. More than you realize. Well, why'd you choose to stop using the Force? When the purge started and our clone troops turned against us, my Padawan and I took several younglings and we went into hiding. But we didn't last long. The Imperial Patrol was about to discover our location, so I tried to lure them away from my Padawan Trilla. She stayed behind with the younglings. But they caught me. And they tortured me. I wanted to know about the others and how many were left, but mostly they wanted to know about Cordova and where he went. But you escaped. No. It was a prison riot. I saw my opportunity and I took it. But they almost broke me. And I am not the same as I was, Cal. Your Padawan. Did she survive? No. But that's why we can't give up. We can't let the sacrifice of those closest to us be for nothing. Please, I'm trying to collect my thoughts. Yeah, you and me, we're unstoppable together. Don't you think, kid, huh? The man is in grades, every time perfect landing. You could say that. Ever piloted a ship before? No, mostly just scrapper transports and Braca. Oh, kid, you gotta get in the cockpit sometime. Feel the controls in your hands and the galaxy in your grasp. Oh, it's unbelievable. Sounds good. Let me know when. Huh? No, not mine. 
Not the Mantis, no way. I'm just saying you should try it sometime. But with someone else's ship. Cordova had supplies hidden all over Bagano. Could be worth a trip back to explore. Today, our great military is dedicated to enforcing the laws of the Empire, yielding to no one who seeks to destroy our galactic harmony. You hear that garbage? Turn it off, please. Lying imps. Do you think anyone buys this junk? Too many on the core worlds. Their daily lives haven't changed much since the Empire took over. Oh, come on. Some of them are even richer than before. Not like the expendable worlds. Not like Latera. As long as the Emperor keeps the right people happy, it'll never stop. That's why we need the Jedi. Then we better get this hollow thing fast. All right, we're here. Get in your chair. You're making good progress, Cal. I'm glad you're with us. Well, we got a galaxy to save. Not an easy task. Are you sure you're up to it? I'll be okay. It's better than hiding on Braca. I've been to many different planets in the galaxy searching for... Well, you. Unless we stop the Empire, we'll all be gone. Hidden or not. I'm ready. Good. You must have come here a lot with Cordova. No. Actually, he never brought me here. He did tell me about it. I was the only one who knew of its location. He trusted you. I suppose he did. He trusted I'd believe him and finish what he started. Hopefully he was right. BD-1 thinks so. He's one bright droid. <laughs> good since I graduated first in my class at the Lateron Space Academy. I wasn't aware Lateron had an academy. Yeah, it was new, back in the day. You probably don't get around that area much. So, what did you train on? Name it. Fighters, freighters, short range, long range, whatever. I flew circles around everybody. You flew freighters in circles? Yeah, it's all they really allowed me to do. I was so good, though. You should have seen me. We're about to drop out of hyperspace. Sit down. Oh, tell me we're not running that blockade. Oh, only as a last resort. I break the Mantis' transponder to transmit Imperial signals. Hey, Grease. Yeah. Keep your power signature low and act like we belong. Just like Braca. No sweat. I don't need another set of hands. Just please keep your eye on the scanner. All please. Right. All right. All right. I don't see anything. You're preoccupied with something on the ground. We're clear. That 
doesn't look good. The Empire is devouring Kashyyyk for its natural resources. Monkeys have been enslaved. Or displaced. Guerrilla fighters, Wookiees and off-worlders ambushing an Imperial convoy. Walker's approaching their position. Tarful could be with them. Tarful could be anywhere, like deep in the ground, like we're gonna be if we get caught up in that battle down there. We don't have any other options, and, and they'll die without our help. So what's your plan? Sabotage. We used to scrap walkers on Braca. I'll just jack one. <laughs> get a load of the kid. He thinks we're back in a Clone Wars. Captain, uh, get us near those walkers. Wait, what? Listen, those walkers double as troop transport, so once you get inside, be careful. I for no freeze grease to work his magic. Hey, do me a favor. Stay alive down there. I'll add it to the plan. <laughs> right, if you're jumping, you better do it now, kid. You ready for a swim, BD? <laughs> Wonder how we get inside. Yeah, I'll try the lake. Okay, now where? Just a little more. Uh -huh. 